this, in my opinion, is just about the prettiest sunfish that you can catch. Uh, this is a pumpkin seed. Uh, <laughs> All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to the Fish Dimension. It is five o'clock on a Sunday. I'm off work today and I'm dying to get on some fish. Uh, any fish will do today. Just want to come out here and relax. Uh, never can to seem to get out here before the late afternoon, but uh, we're here at High Rock Lake and there's a million people here, so I went off into a secluded little cove and we're going to uh, put a worm on and see what we can catch. All right. Got something. Hello. Oof, that is a big green sunfish. Wow. Look at these these vibrant orange tips here. Very light. Sort of a le much less dark green than I'm used to seeing on these guys for sure. It's a pretty one, actually. I like that bright orange. They have been the only thing biting, biting uh, recently. Uh, nobody can get on crappy, nobody can get on bass. It's the post-spawn and the fish are resting, basically. The only thing that's biting are green sunfish, bluegill, and that is it. There's been something right here that keeps nibbling me. Let's see what kind of sunfish it is. I'm sure it ain't anything better than that. Bluegill. Did I call it or what? Hello. You know, I'm so used to fishing crappy, I'm trying to grab everything by the mouth now. When I should not. Alright, well this is a nice one. Good size. If I were doing uh, some outside uh, eating, I'd cook them up for sure. Boy, you made that harder on yourself than it had to be. Jerk. <sighs> Come on. Get going. Ugh. Sorry about the bad handling there. I didn't want to step there because uh, the closer you get to shore here, the, the more your feet sink in the mud. When you bobber... Oh, okay. It just came out. Great. I hate these stupid things. Junk. friggin' junk. God. Fish. You suck. Hmm. Mm. Damn you, fish. What the hell is the problem today? Can't open your mouth? Mmm, there you go. Bluegill again. Hooray. So, this is what we're stuck with. Only the panfish biting. Something really wants it, but can't take it. Guess I put it on the hook pretty well. And we're done. I mean, how small could a fish be if it's out that far? 
I suppose any size really, but God, you know, you're out that far and you can't get this in your mouth. Playing fast and loose with your own safety fish. If I were a big fish and I saw you swimming around, I'd be eating you. Now, where was I? Right out here. I can't remember anything. Oh. I hate having to work. I wish I could just fish every day. I don't know how that wound up being such a piss poor cast. I wanted it to go at least 30% further than that. Always big fish jumping on the other side that I can't get to because of this guy's property. No luck today. Oh, there we go. Instant fish. That's what I like to see. We yay, fun. Oh, lovely. It's a dumb catfish. Oh, now I gotta deal with this slimy little without getting spined somehow. Oh, they're stupid fleshy mouths. Little spines are like just the light right length that if I make a wrong move, it's gonna go into my finger here. That is a uh, channel cat, I believe. Yeah, channel cat. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Oh. Catfish have like the fleshiest mouths in the world of fish. <sighs> oh good, good. Yeah. Hard for that hook to come out. Alright, come here buddy. Hmm, or go. Alright, y'all got a good enough look at him, let's let him go back. Here's a bite. There is like a squirrel hopping around in the woods there or something, and I swear I'm telling you, it sounds like footsteps or something, like someone walking towards me. Been doing that for the last 15 minutes. Stupid squirrel. so distracting. Are you telling me he stripped that hook that quick? Great, great, yeah, so for the last minute and a half I've been trout fishing, wasting footage, battery, all that good stuff. Oh, I've been talking to myself for hours. I come back for some, see what happens this time. Get, come here. Oh, yes. Now we got something uh, worth making uh, a video with this all, all this footage for. Wow, this is a good example too. All right, let me get him free and get away from the water and I'll uh, show you this guy. Now this is uh, one of my favorite fish to catch. Yeah, you're a mile from the water, buddy. You ain't going anywhere. Hold still, this will be over in a minute. Stop. All right, so I just caught this little guy here and uh, this, in my opinion, is just about the prettiest sunfish that you can catch. Uh, this is a pumpkin seed. Uh, so if you take a look at this guy, you can see all the identifying features here. 
uh, green, lots of, lots of greenish blue stripes along the face here. This nice orange uh, spot on the, uh, you know, the periculum there. Uh, and sort of a... Ugh, everything dirty because of this. Including him. I gotta clean his stupid butt off. Oh. I'm an idiot. This is turning out to be a bad day. I'm a moron. Yes. So, uh, yeah, sorry for the outburst. That just ticked me off. Ugh. Are you gonna take this shit or what? was that? You gotta be kidding me. Mm. Line twist every time I throw. Fun fun. I'm not using these stupid bobbers anymore. Spin. Spin, you little sucker. Oh, nice. All right, so just in case it gets away from me, I'm gonna show you right here. Nice little yellow perch. I think that's what's been biting me out there all day and having trouble taking the hook. They have really small mouths. No spines though, so that's cool. Nice little yellow perch. Thought he looked uh, different shaped when I was reeling him in. Yeah, their bodies are more, uh, I guess, what you'd call hydrodynamic. They're thinner, long like bass. So they don't feel like as much when you're uh, reeling them in. I thought I had something really small. What in the world? Come on. All these friggin' problems today. This friggin' line and bobber. I lose my shit entirely. <laughs> oh. Damn, this is annoying. I really don't know how these dudes keep ghosting me. How? How? Oh my god, do one thing with it or another. Now I got gotcha. What are you? Oh, it's you. This green sunfish. You're the same one from earlier, aren't you? No, he's different, but either way. Well, battery's almost dead. Camera probably almost full. That means it's time to shut everything off and probably catch something amazing directly afterwards. Not a bad multi-species day. I think it's safe to say that it's about over now. Hope you enjoyed this episode of the Fish Dimension. And we'll see you again next time. Really? Really?